What are those things I sometimes see you chuck out in the middle of fights? What? You mean my bombs? Bombs? As in the things people use to clear out rocks? But I could have sworn I saw something other than fire burst from some of yours. That's because these aren't ordinary bombs. They're specially made ones filled with astral energy. Hmm, okay. And why do you shoot the bombs after you release them? It's a part of my strategy. The effects of my bombs change when I fire bullets of a different astral element at them. It makes it difficult for enemies to predict what effect they'll have, or when they'll go off. One moment you're using powerful bombs, the next you're using powerful healing arts. They're kinda on the opposite ends of the spectrum, aren't they? Think of it this way. If you ever get caught up in the blast of one of my bombs and you manage not to die, I'll be able to heal you using my arts. Hmm. I'll do my best to not die then. This came out so good, I almost... Shion, could we talk a moment? Do you mind if we chat a bit? Now there's something I never thought I'd hear you say. Remember when we talked about what it was like for me growing up? Well, I thought it only fair that I also get to ask what you were like as a child. My childhood? Maybe you missed the memo that was going around, but... I can't remember anything of my past. I know. Just whatever you can remember. There's gotta be something, right? Hmm. <sighs> Let me think. Well, have I ever told you about my army days? Back when I used to serve under a Dan and Master? Yeah, but that must have been after you were already grown up, right? Do you happen to remember anything from back when you were younger? <sighs> Actually, I remember I had a kid with me. You had a kid? No, of course not. The child's father was another soldier. Back in those days, we risked our lives for a master we'd never even seen. We just fought for them and didn't even question it. When that kid's dad died and I saw them sitting there crying, I felt this bitter, indescribable feeling. It was like I was drinking something toxic that I knew I shouldn't, but couldn't stop. It was strange. I never understood why I reacted like that. Soldiers died every day. It wasn't anything new. What it tells me is that deep down, you were the same man then as you are now. You've never been able to accept injustice in the world. If you keep talking like that, you're going to embarrass me. I wonder whatever happened to that master and poor kid. Not that there's any way of knowing now. You know, I just remembered that kid was good at sewing dolls. They gave me one once. It was a good luck charm to protect me. Dolls? I'm looking forward to breakfast. Morning. Ready to head out?